Hello everyone, I am Santosh. Today we are going to discuss the practical part of C programming means how to execute the programs online without installing anything. Okay, for that you need just internet and a browser software and a system. Okay, see I will open the Google Chrome browser and then I will type just google.com okay from here i want to open an online compiler website that is onlinegdb.com okay it is an online compiler and a debugger debugging means the process of finding and fixing the errors okay it is the platform which provides us online compilation as well as uh, finding errors and fixing errors tool okay for all programming languages and it is the world's first online IDE which gives debugging facility with embedded GDB debugger GDB implies GNU debugger okay let us type online gdb compiler okay search it see you can see the first website and click on it which says online gdb debugger compiler okay you can see the home page where already some code has been written okay and you can minimize this and I want to erase all the code which is already written okay and here you can see the language you need to select as C and there are so many languages supported by this online gdb i will select the c language and here you can write the code this is the editor which is provided by online gdb.com okay i will write the code here we will write the simple program to print your name on the screen or terminal okay i will write the code here you can observe ash include stdr.h is the preprocessor statement and then wide main as you know every program has a main function and just i want to print for print we have a printf function print function okay I'll print my name which is a string that's why it should be written in double quotes and every statement in C ends with semicolon okay shall we execute see there is a button called run which executes your code just click on it and here you can see the output below which is showing Santosh that is the output which is executed by this program okay correct see if I do any errors here I will remove the semicolon now you try to execute see it shows the error like it is expecting semicolon okay if any errors are there it is shown by the compiler okay very simple to execute and there is no need of any installation of any software just open it write the code and run or shall we execute another program that is addition of two numbers okay i will remove it 
I'll write another code. Already we have written the code. Just I want to show you the practical part. I'm writing the code to add two numbers. To add two numbers, we need two variables to store the values A and B and I want to store the result in C. Okay. And prompt the user to enter two values. Just show the message to enter two values. By using printf statement and store the values in A and B. And both are of integers. That's why the format specifier is percentage D. And store the first value in A and second value in B. Now you can directly write the formula C is equal to A plus B. And print the result stored in C which is of type integer. And you can show the message as sum is equal to percentage D because it is an integer. And where the data is stored? Data is stored in C. Program is correct. You can check by executing. I'll run the code. See, it is asking for us to enter two values. I will enter two values. Six and five. Showing the exact result that is sum is equal to 11. Very simple to execute. The editor is very fine and it is recognizing that you are writing the C code. And if any errors are there, it is showing it also. Okay, is it easy? You all can try and execute some of the programs without installing any software. Okay, thank you.